Hey viewers, welcome to another game of Casual Pro Gamer. Today we are doing an Amumu game, and this is of course the montage. The full game is up as well, I will post the link in the comments. So uh, we are starting off with the wolves into blue, and Morgana steals about a level worth of experience in blue. Um, so yeah, Amumu is a little bit behind at first. But then, um, yeah, he's trying to come back by ganking this middle lane. Unfortunately, does not get anything done. And um, a little bit later, we do find our first kill here. It is um, Vigar who is overextending uh, with Volibear. And uh, Volibear, of course, not a good target. So they go for the Vigar. And um, yeah, this is uh, <laughs> Zyra, who is um, the support in this game. Uh, actually thinks she can uh, kill the Mumu, but that's of course not going to work. Unfortunately, Morgana does not run out in time and with a flash tumble, uh, yeah, well, she gets killed. Then um, Vigar, yeah, sees with the ward that there is an Amumu in the bush and instead of just running away, he <laughs> runs right into it and Amumu making sure that he grabs that kill. So um, a little bit later then, we see this guy planting a ward, and Mumu sees that guy planting a ward. Immediately grabs him with the, uh, or her, with the bandage toss and lands another kill. So um, coming top lane here to gank, but there's nobody there. Then um, <laughs> the volley bear comes to gank as well. Uh, immediately switching targets here because, well, the better target is of course that Lee Sin. Lee Sin using his flash and his safeguard to get out of that. Then um, counter jungling a little bit, but what's way more important, he sees this mid laner uh, who is, well, not really overextending, but apparently, well, overextending a little bit too much. Well, extending a little bit too much. It w he wasn't really in any danger, it was just that Mumu came in from the back and he got some really nice killing going. So um, then in the bottom lane, a double kill for, uh, for Zyra. Who uh, was helped there, of course, by uh, the Volley Bear. But Volley Bear is going to recall. And, um, okay, Volley Bear is now going to recall again. Uh, and, yeah, Amumu just guessing where he is and guessing right, immediately getting that kill and running back out. So, um, Blue Buff then. Yeah, he uh, doesn't know that the Blue Buff is up, but decides, well, I'll go for it anyway. And unfortunately does not get anything more done than just a little bit of damage. Then um, we're getting into the more interesting part of this game. We are going for a gank right in turret range uh, with two allies. And taking quite a lot of turret damage but it is not a problem. They get a kill. Uh, they get the turret and they, um, well, let one guy get away, but so did the enemies. Then uh, Amumu, yeah, here caught by three, four enemies. And yeah, just no way he was going to get out of that. But are they going to pick up a kill back? Well, the rest of the team is trying. They are going to run after everyone. And it seems that they are not going to manage to do anything here. Um, yeah. Just kind of sad. So, <laughs> we're still running around because, well, everyone is still here. And then, yeah, this guy is all of a sudden there. Wasn't in the bush and just gets caught. Um, yeah, well, we are going to continue on. And it is now uh, a 3 four, for 2 And it is going to be a 4 for 2 trade. There you go. So, not a very good... Uh, way to do that but yeah well four for two at least they got two kills right so uh, Amumu landing a brilliant Q there but and the th there's third stun coming in so uh, first he lands his Q which is a stun then his ultimate that's a stun and then the Tarek stun and that was just too much to handle so anyway um, yeah we see the stop lane he misses the bandit stars this time even though it was a very easy one compared to some of the other ones that he did land but they do grab the kill with the ignite and that is of course good enough so um, a little bit of a fight breaking out here uh, just under the mid lane Sivra gets killed instantly she wasn't having a very good game uh, kill wise because she got killed quite a lot um, yeah, Amumu came in a little bit late and um, are they going to make anything out of this because they know that there are a lot of enemies around. Well, in fact, the entire enemy team is here. And we may actually be able to pick up some kill, but 
Yeah, we're going to have to back off for a moment because it is three versus five, and um, yeah, we're going to come back in in a uh, well right now. And Vigar, of course, yeah, he is very squishy. The jump comes in from Pantheon, and is he going to do anything? The flash from Amumu gets him out of range and out of his uh, well, the, out from the people that were focusing him. A double kill, a triple kill for the team. And then this happens, the stun goes off, or the snare goes off, but no AoE damage coming out from uh, Morgana. And um, yeah, she missed that kill, but the rest of the team picks it up. So uh, excellently done, turned that around, and um, yeah, well played. So the entire enemy team coming in, the teleport comes in, but it is still 2 versus 5, although all of the skills have been used by now. Then trying to get away and a brilliant stun once again he just he's, he keeps landing them he keeps landing them it is crazy mode so um four guys still in the bush here and currently it is a one for one trade so that is not too bad well that's in fact quite good but yeah they are not going to be able to do anything look at that Vigar getting out at no HP at all and then uh, Vayne getting out at no HP at all. The ultimate from uh, Tarek really, really late. And I don't know if he had that up, but if he had that up and Amumu would have been in range of that aura, he would have uh, landed two kills easily. But yeah, well, they didn't. Because Tarek wanted to have his... Uh, well, have the damage of that ultimate instead of the aura uh, of it. And yeah, this was this was also very good. The jump comes in once again and <laughs> just owns owns that Zyra, who was the only one that stuck around to uh, to keep doing damage. So Mumu, yeah, he uh, he kind of got uh, got caught. Well, not really caught. He uh, met some enemies, and they are going to try to get something done here. It is going to be. Just a slaughter on both sides, uh, lots of damage from both teams, but it is in fact the blue team coming out ahead in this, for now, but that is not going to stay like, well it is going to stay like that, but it is an ace for two, uh, they are at least going to grab that second kill, and <laughs> yeah Pantheon of course not too happy with that, but uh, well. A 5 for 2 is an excellent trade. So after pushing two turrets in that bottom lane, two of the enemies stay in, the rest returns uh, home. And uh, the two actually get sniped there by Amumu. Amumu of course very strong by now, he has a lot of kills, a lot of gold. And yeah, just look at this fight, this is a very, very, very long fight. Uh, where everyone is just engaging one by one and... Uh, yeah, it is just not a brilliant fight by the blue team, but the result of it is pretty brilliant. So Mumu getting focused, flashes out, and everyone just dies on our team. But it is Mumu who is going to come out ahead here. He is going to land a yeah pentakill and just stands around. He forgot to run away. He uh, sent that in his email. That yeah, he just he, he was so shocked that <laughs> he couldn't run away anymore. Anyway, a little bit later, we see the same situation. Three guys in the bush here, and um, unfortunately, that is not going to work out for them this time because there is no backup. Amu is not coming in yet, and even when he comes in, he will now come in. He is going on that uh, on that vein, but look at this. They realize how much of a threat he is. Uh, Lee Sin immediately kicks him out and there is no more damage to be done. So a 3 for 1 in the end. Enemy is going for a uh, dragon, but yeah, well, we can't have that of course. We are going to attempt to get at least one kill here. It should have been 3, but it is going to be, well, 2 I guess. And maybe... No, not not the last one. Yeah, Mumu not able to uh, land that Q, but is no, he doesn't he doesn't catch up. But Mumu is still there, and Mumu with his brilliant Qs actually lands it and is going to uh, 
well to get that third kill as well. So they lost the dragon, but they got three kills for it. And they are actually able to do Baron by now. So uh, doing the Baron, no problem. And we are going to go into the enemy jungle. And look at this Disley Sin, man. Oh man, I can take him. He only has like 19 kills. So uh, I can easily take him with my 5 kills. Yeah, so he get, not only gets himself killed, he also gets the Zyra killed. Just insanely bad play on the Lee Sin. But yeah, well, that happens sometimes. Volibear comes in. Volibear is going to flash out. And we're going to see him uh, later in this fight. Because this also is a fight where everyone comes in one by one. <laughs> yeah, the Amumu got stunned. So Sivra gets to finish that kill. So uh, Volibear tries to uh, defend this turret. Is not going to manage to do that. In fact, he is going to get killed. And then the last fight. Obviously, we're going to win at this point. Amumu just tanking the damage from everyone and might actually pick up a kill yes he is going to pick up a kill ends up with 23 kills and um, yeah four enemies dead only Zyra still alive and um, yeah we're just going to end it right here right now Vygar landing the, the ultimate but it is not good enough he stays alive so 23 and 3 hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time GG